Facebook, Instagram, Snapchat, Pinterest, almost everyone's on social media, but how secure is your personal information? I think people trust the internet too much. It's quite attractive for uh, cyber criminals to, to, to browse through all of that information and collect as much as they can on us. Well, many of you might think your personal information has some level of protection on social media. Some, at least. But tonight's Help Me Hank report might have you rethinking the information you share. Consumer investigator Hank Winchester looks at why our social media accounts are so attractive to hackers. If you were just walking down the street and you were approached by a stranger who asked you for your personal information, I'm guessing you would say no. But think about it. Each time you post updates on social media, you could be showing hackers and crooks how to track you down. Hackers targeting social media. Thousands of adults in America say it has happened to them. I definitely know that my friends are being hacked, so it doesn't surprise me. It doesn't surprise me. Um, people share a lot of private information on there and um, there's not a lot of security measures. Many of you may take precautions, but this cybersecurity expert says your security settings may actually give you a false sense of security. The important thing to remember here is that everything uh, that they post is publicly available. That's right, everything you post is publicly available. Dan Kozin of Phoenix University says your security settings offer some control over who sees what. But if a hacker wants to see the information you have posted, they'll find a way to find it. It's simply just a screen, and a cyber criminal can peek behind that screen and see all the information that somebody has posted. Many of you may wonder why hackers even care about your social media accounts and what you post online. When I think about identity theft that could hurt me financially, I don't necessarily think about social media. Hacking your social media accounts may not hurt you immediately, but hackers can use that information you've posted against you at a later date. For example, they can find out your birth date, where you work, your address, your email. All that information could be used to steal your identity. People overshare. They know their locations. They know if they're home. They know if they're not. They know where they go. Criminals also hack your social media accounts trying to unleash malware or viruses that could steal more private information from your computer. And they may use your account to spam your friends with malware or a virus. We definitely see more and more of like my friends sending me things that obviously aren't them. So that's like almost a weekly occurrence. Other than rethinking your posting habits entirely, what can you do to protect yourself? First, make sure you have a good antivirus protection loaded into your computer. Use more secure passwords and keep your social media passwords separate from passwords you use for your financial accounts. Beware of all those quizzes and those games online. Some could be trying to gather more information from you. Finally, limit your friends and your contacts to people that you only truly know. If we don't know who they are, they could be cyber criminals actually collecting information to use against us. And I've posted more information about how to protect yourself and your family online. You'll find it all on the homepage of ClickOnDetroit.com. I'm Hank Winchester. Back to you. Some good tips. One of the things I didn't know is the location services on your right. phone. If that's on and you take a picture, you post that picture. Oh, look, Kimberly's know. not in town. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah so good, good tips. Yeah.